Would you like to see what I'm making? It's a cup, and I've written the letters H-E-L-P. Those letters spell the word help. I'll put the cup here in the library, and people can drop in coins. When the cup is full of money, I can buy a book for a boy or girl who doesn't have one. I brought some coins to put in the cup too. Let's count the coins as I drop each one into the cup. Are you ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Wow, ten coins. Maybe some other people will give money too. Do you like to help others? It's good to show love to others and help them. Today's Bible story is about people at church who helped. Listen to hear what they did. The people at the church in Jerusalem heard about a new church in Antioch. They sent Barnabas to visit the Antioch church. When Barnabas arrived in Antioch, he saw that many people believed in Jesus. Barnabas was glad. He encouraged the people to keep loving and obeying Jesus. Many more people in Antioch began to believe that Jesus was God's son. Then Barnabas went to Tarsus to search for Saul, and when he found him, he brought him to Antioch. Barnabas and Saul worked together and helped each other. They stayed in Antioch for a year and taught the people more about Jesus. One day, a man named Agabus came to the Antioch church. He explained that soon the people in Judea would not have enough food to eat. Many people would be hungry. The people in the Antioch church decided to help. Each person gave as much as he could. Then Barnabas and Saul took the gifts to the people in Judea. The people at the church in Antioch wanted to help the people in Judea. Do you remember how they helped? Good listening! Each person gave what he could. Then Barnabas and Saul took the church's gifts to the people in Judea. The Antioch church showed God's love by helping the people in Judea. When Jesus lived on earth, he showed us how we should love and help others. Jesus gave food to people who were hungry and healed people who were sick. Jesus loves and helps people. God wants us to be like Jesus, showing God's love to others and being good helpers. How does your church help others? One way churches can help is collecting money. They can use the money to help people have the things they need. Churches also can collect clothes and food to give to people who need help. Most importantly, people at church can pray for others and tell them about Jesus. I'm excited to collect coins and help kids have new books. What can you do to help others? Be thinking about ways you can help. You might help your family members, your friend, or a neighbor. Helping others is a great way to be like Jesus and show God's love. I'm glad you stopped by the library today. I want to hear about all of the ways that you choose to help this week. I'll see you again soon.